What's up team? I'm back with another full body intense HIIT workout. In just 30 minutes, you'll be feeling the burn all over. There's no equipment needed in this workout as we're only using our body weight. Plus, there are no repeats, so you won't get bored. When you're ready, I'll meet you right back here on the mat. All right, so let's get started with a quick warm up. And we're gonna start off with some step overs. We just raise your foot, come up with the knee, stretch the groin. So in two, one, go. When you're doing this one, you wanna try and keep your upper body as stable and straight as possible. Ten more seconds. And then we're gonna go down into a runner stretch. So basically come down into a plank and then come up with your right foot and twist with your hand. Look up at your hand, come back down, switch the feet and look up with the hand. Come back down, switch the feet. Feel free to hold this position for a while. Stretch the groin, come up with the arm, and back down. Switch it. Right, one more. And then come back up. We're gonna do a quad stretch. Just Grab your foot and it helps to put out the hand, make some counterbalance on the other side and switch. And switch. You want to push your hip forward to feel the stretch in your quad even more. Right, we're gonna go into some shoulder rolls, warm up the upper body. Basically just roll your shoulders, start backwards. Switch forward. Alright, go back again, and that is it, time, warm up is done, let's get into the workout. We're gonna start off with some seal jacks, and it's like a jumping jack, but instead of going with the arms overhead, we're gonna go with the arms to the sides. Let's go. Open up that chest. You guys keep going. I forgot to turn on the watch to count the calories. There we go. 10 more seconds. Ah. All right, 
Now we're gonna do some quick feet. And you're gonna start off in a running position. And then you're gonna go out with the left, out with the right, out with the left, out with the right. Just like this. And then when you're ready, pick up the pace, the faster. Feel it in the calves. If you think this is too hard, just go step out. Step out like this. Let's go back. Two, one, and rest. Good. Now we're gonna go into a small shuffle. So, on your toes, and just go like this. In three, two, one, go. Stay on your toes, engage the arms into the motion. Three, two, one, and time. All right, no stopping. Now we're gonna go into some punches. And I want you to take a boxing stance position. So if you're right-handed, right foot comes back, left foot forward, and you're gonna punch like this. And when you punch, I want you to twist your hand and pick up the pace. Here we go. Come on, good job. Okay, and rest. Now we're gonna go into a squat pose. To get into the squat position, you wanna have your feet at width or shoulder width apart, point the toes, and come down into a squat, small pulse, and come back up. Small pulse, come back up. You wanna have your knees at a 90 degree angle. When you come down, and keep your chest upright. Very good. Squeeze the glutes when you come up. Right. Now we're gonna do a squat hold with step outs. So get back into the squat position, but you're not gonna go as far down. You're gonna hold it about here, and then you're gonna step out with one foot, and then step out with the other one. Just like this. If you can go lower, go lower. You're gonna feel it in your quads. And step with the toe. All right, good job. Now we're gonna go down into 
some normal push-ups. So, if you're having trouble doing push-ups, just do them on the knees, no problem. Just down. Or do the normal ones. I like to breathe on the way down and breathe out on the way out, up. Ten more seconds. And time. Good job. Let's stay down on the mat. We're going to go into a low plank and a leg raise. So, go into the low plank position. And you're going to do one, two, one, two. Pace yourself. Couple more seconds. And time. All right. I'm gonna go into a race. Bicycle crunches, stay on the mat, put down your elbows, open up the chest, coming with the knee. As you come in with the knee, try to keep the other leg straight above the mat, don't touch the floor. Ten more seconds. And time. All right. And do some sit-ups. With your hands overhead. Pretend that you're holding a weight over your head. Come up and hold it up. Control it on the way down and come back up. All right, stay on the mat, and do some glute bridges. These ones are standard. You know how to do these. Ready, squeeze up, squeeze your glutes. You can also come up on your heels with the feet. Good job. Catch our breath a little bit here. And squeeze. Couple more. Good job. 
Let's get up again. Now we're gonna do a step back with a lunge. So, step back with your foot and then step back in and down into a lunge. Switch the feet, step back, lunge. Step back, lunge. And keep up the pace. I'm already sweating bunches. Let's go, step out, lunge. One more, time. All right, good job. Now we're gonna go into some tuck jacks. So basically, you're gonna jump, and instead of coming up with your hands, you're gonna clap between your legs. And go, just like this. Yes. Get that heartbeat up. Burn some calories. All right. Three, two, one, time. All right, one more for this round. We're gonna do some side-to-side -side punches. And here, you're gonna either, I'm gonna show you two variations. You're either gonna go like this, punch, or if you don't have enough space, just do punch, 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 punch. Come out with the leg, punch, punch. All right, and let's go. Look where you punch. Bam, time. All right, good job. That's round one. Let's catch our breath. Couple of seconds rest. And we're gonna go into round two. All right, let's get started with round two. We're gonna start with some 45 degree jumps or jumping jacks. So basically you're gonna do a jumping jack, but instead you're gonna come up in a 45 degree angle like this. Keep up the pace. Couple more seconds. Time. Ooh. All right. Now we're gonna go into a crisscross. So let's keep with the jumping. Keep the heartbeat up. So for the crisscross, cross the feet like this. Stay on your toes. And if you want to make it a little bit harder, you can incorporate the arms. Just stay like this. 
Ooh, I messed it up. Ha. Ten more seconds. All right, rest. Good job. Now we're gonna go into some runners and you're gonna put your weight on your left leg, go into a runner's position and then come out, put the toe so you keep the balance and come back in and go like this. When you feel ready, you can stop putting down the toe on the ground and keep here. And if you feel like you're losing the balance, just put down your toe and regain your balance. And pick up, pick up the pace. Working the balance, coordination. Couple more seconds. Time, all right. We're gonna do the exact same thing on the other leg. Balance on the right foot. Come into a runner's position. Step back, step out with your foot. And go. And when you're ready, stop using the foot at the back. Engage your arms in the movement. Ten more seconds. Come on, I know it's, it's burning on your right calf. Keep going. And time. Woo. All right. Now we're gonna do some wood chops. For this one, I want you to pretend that you're holding a weight Over your head, you're gonna go down into a lunge and come down with the weight on your left side. Come up, switch the legs and come down with the weight on your right side. Up, down. Three, two, one, and time. Okay, now we'll go into a one-two step. So for this one, get into the runner's position. One, two, and come up. So one, two, up. One, two, up. And join me. Come on, couple more. Keep it up. Ten more seconds. Time. Woo. Good job. Now we're gonna go into push up to bear. So come down into the mat. You're gonna go into a push up. And you're gonna come down like this into the bear position. Up, push up.
time. All right. Now we're gonna go into reverse bridge plus thrust. So for this one, you can either keep your hands like this, or you can face them towards your body. Come up into the reverse bridge, down and up, down and up. So the way that you hold your hands is gonna be easier or harder. Facing your body is harder. It's gonna take more on the tricep. If you switch the hands like this, you're gonna feel it's a little bit easier. So when you come up, squeeze the glutes. Couple more seconds. One more. Come on. Yeah. All right. Good job. Now we're gonna go into some abs. We're gonna do L leg raises. So. On your elbows, open up the chest and come up with the leg. Try to keep your leg as straight as possible and squeeze your abs when you come up. And if you want to make this exercise a little bit harder, keep your alternate leg up above the ground while you're doing this. Or just place it down. And time. All right. Now we're gonna do a cocoon. I believe it's called. We're gonna come with the legs straight. Come the arms, come up into a cocoon. Straight, arms and legs above the ground, come in into a cocoon. And when you're doing this, you wanna keep your lower back pressed into the mat. Now we're gonna do a hip raise with abduction. I'm gonna start off from this side. Put your elbow on line with your shoulder, knee on top of the other knee, and come up and do an abduction. So up with the knee, come down, and up. Just like this. Work those abs, obliques, and the glutes with the abduction. Come on. A couple more. All right, good job. We're gonna switch the sides. So, Remember, knee on top of knee, foot on top of foot, elbow on top of shoulder, and come up. Can feel it. Ah, come on. Couple more. 
All right, good job. And do a glute bridge and a sit up. So we're gonna start with a glute bridge into a sit up. Control your weight on the way back from the sit up. All right, good job. Going to a low plank plus knee to chest. Okay, ready? Come into the plank and coming with your knee as close as you can to your chest. And when you're going, you want to keep the knee as close to the mat as possible. And keep up the pace. And time. All right, last one, guys. We're gonna crush it with jumping lunges. Jumping lunges into explosive push-ups. So just follow along, let's get it. One, two, three, four, into a push-up. One, two, three, four. Come back up, jumping lunges. One, two, three, four. Come on, give it all you got. You're already reaching the end. Let's go. And push ups. One. Ah, last one. See. And woo. Ah. that is a killer. If you made it this far, you are a beast. Well done. Woo. Look at me, I'm drenching sweat. Calories burned today 450 calories. That's not counting the warm up. All right, thank you for joining me today. I'll see you in the next one.